Well, March is reading month and one local kid is not only encouraging his classmates to read, but he is hoping to inspire them pr to pursue their dream job in his new book. Michelle Oliver is in the studio with the story. Hi, Michelle. Well, hey guys, so his name is George Latham IV and he is just eight years old and the author of two books, I Can Be and I Can Be Sports Edition. We have them right here. And he and his mother Latoya are joining us on set to talk about his work. So welcome to the show. Hi, thanks Thank for you. having us. Oh Thank gosh. you. I, I'm, so I gotta tell you, I am so <clears throat> impressed with you. Eight years old, the author of two books. What are your books about? Can you describe them for me? One of my books are about you can be what you want to be, and one of them is about you can, um, and his, one of them is about sports. Mm. Yeah. And so the sports one is the most new, is the newest release, right? Yes, it's the newest release. And you were, you know, a whole eight years old when you wrote this one, and you were telling me earlier, this one has a little bit more, are they more reading books? Are they more activity books? Let's take a look inside and see what we can show people. All right. So what is the, the I Can Be Sports Edition? Which one's this one a little bit more? Is it more reading in this one? Yes, that is more reading. Yeah, you can see that one. So you have coloring books in here, you have activities. Now, Latoya, you said George has always been a reader? Yes, he started when he was at two years old. Wow. Two years old, that's yes. so impressive. So, George, why did you want to write a book? I wanted to write a book. Uh, so my mom asked me how how do I want to make money? Mm -hmm. I said I want to write a book because I love to read. <laughs> That's very cool. And so how did you come up with the idea for the book? Um, so um, first, so first the idea. Yeah. yeah. So the idea with the book. So I decided to um, put some reading and activities in it and and it's also, and I uh, let them color it too. And um, so also, um, that's the, the illustrator, the front, isn't it? Yeah, this is me on the front. Yeah, I saw that <laughs> picture you had earlier. So, Mom, how did you get his book actually published? Because it's a whole thing to come up with an idea, come up with a story, but. This is a book you can actually buy online. So yes. how did you get that done? So pretty much we did the research, my husband and I, and then we let him write. And we just did the editing ourselves. We just wanted him to have as much as possible into the book. So he did the writing and then we found an illustrator, Latasha Haith, and she helped us design and then we published on Amazon. That's so incredibly cool. And so you can order these off of Amazon. George, what's it like seeing other kids read your book? And I'm just gonna show some pictures here so you guys can kind of see it but what's it like when you see somebody reading your book I feel it's it's like great because um, I like to see them reading my book and and it just makes me feel happy very cool so what uh, I asked him earlier so this is all about things you can be different like jobs different yes. sports yes. what do you want to be I want to be a basketball player. Very cool. So I'm <laughs> expecting your basketball player to be drawn in. Oh, you got one right here. <laughs> when you're when on yours. So as a mom with two kids who started their own businesses, how do you support your child and help them create make their dream a reality? Um, I pretty much just ask them things that they want to do. Um, I don't want to force anything on them, but I do want them to know the importance of having their own and entrepreneurship. Um, I came from a family of entrepreneurship. My mom had her own business. I run multiple businesses. So I just want them to make sure that they have generational wealth and they know the importance of financial literacy. That's awesome. So really quick, how can people find your books? Um, on Amazon for nine dollars, and this one mm -hmm. f on Amazon for ten ninety nine. Ten ninety nine. It's got more reading in it, so it's worth a little more, right? Yes. Exactly. Well, thank you so much for joining us, Tati and Jason. Over to you guys.